Excel Tips and Tricks Creating Parent-Child Drop-Down Lists Sometimes it's helpful to associate multiple items, like countries and cities, or divisions and regions, or territories and branches. Getting the first drop-down list is easy, but what about the second, or third? In this video, you'll learn how to create parent-child relationships using drop-down data validation lists. This simple example associates favorite cities with favorite countries, and yes, you could add a grandchild list of favorite restaurants within those cities. The first step is to create named ranges for each of the lists. Note, make sure that the named ranges for the child lists are exactly the same as items in the parent. You can do a double check by opening formulas from the toolbar and selecting Name Manager. Finally, you only have to create one data validation dropdown to make all the child lists work. Just point an indirect formula at the cell containing the parent item and make sure that it's fully anchored. BizNet Software, connecting your world to Excel.